Okay, betting nation. So welcome. It's Sunday morning. It's eight twenty-two. Um, got to be really, really quick today uh, because I am taking my lad to Burnley versus Chelsea. Never been to a game before, so I'm massively excited about that. Um, I've been to a game before, obviously. I mean, he hasn't been for a game before. Um, so loads of people have been asking me to show you more videos about the software, um, as in what it can do. So this video is a perfect opportunity. I haven't looked at any in-play trades today. I just don't have time. I'm going on holiday tomorrow, so I'm trying to get as much done as humanly possible. So let me just quickly run through the features. So firstly, and what, what it can do. Um, I'll definitely miss some out, so please don't think this is all it can do because it can do loads. Right, so races. This is a races tab. This tells you every single race that's running today. So let's, for example, let's go to injury, three o'clock race, and it will then show you every single horse that, I thought it said Foden then, Phil Foden. <laughs> um, yeah, so it'll show you every single horse in the race. It has a spotlight comments as well from a racing post. It has this little handy tool here, which I absolutely love, by the way. It's a horse racing tracker. Look, many, many sites have them. It's not unique to us at all, but it's something else that we can have in one place. We put the comments in here. Um, I don't want to do it because otherwise it'll keep emailing me. And it'll come down there with an ID stamp for you. And then it will literally tell you, uh, your comments there and your date you put it in. And then it will email you the night before this horse runs again. So really interesting there. I love the comments in running, uh, the comments, the spotlight comments there. We can filter it out by green as well and gold. If you look in our settings here, you, this basically means, look, I want to show, uh, show me horses in gold that have decreased in price by 40%. You can change the percentage. This means show me horses that have decreased in price by 60%. Whatever it may be, you can completely change that to whatever you want. Form histories, how many races back do you want to show this and that? So is it 10 races? Is it five races? Is it two races? Is it three races? Whatever you want, you can you can see there. Uh, Dob criteria is basically saying, look, how many times, um, what percentage, this is for the Dob, Dob button here, what percentage of the last five do you want me to show you horses that have dobbed? Hopefully that makes sense, but it's all it's all there anyway. Um, and it can display today, display tomorrow, handicaps only, whatever you want. And so we press cross because we've already got it. And so we can display it by green if we want to. So we can see the horses that have this make. Oh, look at that. It could be a later back, this one. So let's have a look. Comments in running. This is unusual. What is happening here? There we go. <laughs> that doesn't normally take that long. Um, so why? Why is this? Anyway. <laughs> I look at me. I'm getting. I'm getting sucked in that, and I'm thinking, oh, later back, there's a potential here. <laughs> so this one hasn't greened. Um, in so don't forget our settings. Our green is 60%. So we green means show me horses. Well, highlight the horses that have greened that have gone have decreased in price by 60%. As you can see in the last five runs, no, 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 no. Hence, no percent. Very, very close here. Very, very close, mind you. But still hasn't done so. 3.86 only went down to 3.5. Um, nearly dobbed there. A dob is 50% um, there. So it's decreased in price by 50%. Um, so 3.93. Anyway, so that's that's bad advice. So, and not only that, so what you can see is here is comments in running. For, I mean, where else can you see comments in running so quickly? Boom, 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 boom. And so obviously comments in running there. You just go all the way down. And now we have this fixed. We have these stable, these positions here. We didn't have that stable before. But like I say, we're improving all the time, so that'll be good. Um, uh, so, yeah, we can see what's happened there very, very quickly. We can see Bet B. We can see anything you want to see. You can just see it there at such a level. And Dob ratio, um, we can see how many percent it's been in gold. If you want to highlight it from green first. So these are the ones. Look, five from five. It has come down in price by over 60%. For 100% times last five. So look, uh, made all, held up. <laughs> made all and then held up. What chance have we got? <laughs> jumped slightly left. Sometimes jumped awkwardly. That's interesting. Um, still there, 3.22. Only ever went to a bet fair high of 4.4. Um, very, I ah, love it. Um, 1.79 Betfair SP only went to a higher 2.54. So that's, that's I mean, it's out my realm there because Betfair current price is 22s. So anyway, you get you get the point where you can do. It's really incredible. And you can search, search it by gold as well. Search it by dob ratio. 
And by the way, this is a full on sales pitch, isn't it? And let's make no mistakes about it. This is a full on sales pitch. Um, we can sort by DOB ratio, we can sort by DOB percentage, and we can sort also by Betfair current price, which I like to do as well. Uh, so we can see this one's a favorite, second favorite, third favorite, yada, 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 yada. Um, what other features do we have? I don't know. Um, so back to lay, back to lay very, very, I'll tell you what, I'm going to show you the DOB button first of all, because um, we'll do it in order. And by the way, over here, what we're going to have as well, we're going to have a lay to back button as well, because at the minute we don't have a lay to back. Um, and so we need to we need to get that sorted. And um, we'll get you one in there very, very soon. Hopefully in the next couple of weeks. So by the time the next, next opening is of the course of the membership, then we'll have one. So here, Wexford, if we're not interested at all, we just go like this. And we can just get rid of them. Do, 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 do. And then we can go down. These are the these are the back to layers. So let's sort them out by these, sorry, these are dobs. So let's sort them. You can sort them out again. You can sort them out by whatever you want. Um Let's sort them out by amount of, of times they've actually dobbed. So five from five. There we go. Perfect one. Fifty to one though. So again, it's out of my realm because it's not in it's not in my what I like to take. Again, we can see look, they've they've dobbed. Oh, blow my neck, it's dobbed. This horse has dobbed the last one, two, three, four. Yeah, well, a, a lot. It's dobbed the last lot. <laughs> but again, um, just so, just because it's dubbed once before or six times before, it doesn't mean it's going to dub the seventh time. For me, you need to look past the figures. There's reasons why, and and there's reasons why it dubbed, and you've got to see why it dubbed and what. Um, if that can be replicated today, just because it's dubbed previously, it doesn't mean it's definitely going to dub again. So please, please don't think that this is a money grabbing tree and it's dead, you know, dead easy because you're going to make loads of money because look, it's dub slash six. It's definitely going to dub again. Now we can earn some extra money, easy money, because it's just not like that. Guys, money doesn't come for not hard work and for not putting effort in. Um, so I always say put more effort than than just the figures. There's a reason. There's more research to be done. Anyway, we do a full course on that. So yeah, again, this is Dobbs is really, really interesting because we've got a list of potential horses that have dobbed in our criteria there. So that's really interesting. We can filter them whichever way you want. You can filter them by Betfair current price as well. If you don't want all this shenanigans here because it just gets in the way, back to lay is exactly the same. It's absolutely exactly the same as Dobbs, apart from it doesn't have the shenanigans. It just keeps it simple. Keep it simple, stupid. Look, it just has a list of horses. That's it. If that is more to your liking, then that's fine, because the reason I did this is one of my friends, they should be all lined up neat, shouldn't they? Rather, anyway, uh, one of my friends says, Dean, I don't care about the spotlight comments. I only, because he only, he does it just by the, Data. That's all he uses, data. But he's got special criteria that he uses. And he does very, very well out of it. But he said, Dean, I don't care about the spotlight comments. It doesn't interest me whatsoever. Um, and I just want to keep it simple. And I thought, well, that's great. Because if you think like that, and somebody else might think like that. So that's why we did back to layers like this. Um, hopefully, if... And by the way, um, oh, there's a reset button there. I don't know. Oh, never mind. <laughs> there's a user guide as well with loads of videos. But um, we haven't really... The design of it needs to be a lot, lot better. Uh, but again, it was more important for me just to get the videos up and running for you guys. Um, it was more important that I got the videos up than anything else. And look, there we go. We've got them all up there for you guys to, to help. And there's loads and loads of videos on YouTube as well. Um, so basically, that is it in a nutshell, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed this tomorrow. Again, it'll probably be a really, really simple video. Um, it won't be into too much detail. And I go on holiday next week. But what I'm going to do, I'm still going to do videos for you guys because I do think it's really, really important. And to be quite honest... We're getting such a great response from it as well from you guys. Uh, people emailing me, people getting in touch, and it's fantastic. So hopefully it's giving you guys some value as well because that's what it's all about. Um, done a really good video yesterday, by the way. About to upload it today. Um, it's a case study, and I've got the full case study because we go into the results today, um, which is exciting as well. Right, Betty Nation, thank you so much for joining me again. It's been a long one again. Uh, it was only supposed to be a quick one because, like I said, I've got to go. All right, Betty Nation, thank you so much. Speak to you soon. Bye-bye.